Repair Clinic makes fixing things easy. With millions of replacement parts available on our website and the help you need to do the repair yourself. Since we encourage you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the rotor in your washer, be sure to unplug the power cord. Using a T20 Torx bit or a quarter inch socket or nut driver, unthread the screws securing the rear access panel. Loosen the center top screw, but don't remove it. Now slide the panel to the right to remove and set it aside. Use an 11 16th inch socket or wrench and strike it with a mallet to loosen the rotor mounting bolt. Unthread the bolt and pull off the old rotor. Install the new rotor by carefully aligning it on the stator. Thread and tighten the mounting bolt. Hook the rear access panel on the top screw and slide it to the left. Tighten the screw. Rethread and tighten the remaining mounting screws. With the repair completed, plug the power cord back in, and your washer should be ready for use. At Repair Clinic, we make fixing things easy. Thank you for supporting the production of these videos by purchasing your parts from our website.